educate and socialize locally as well as globally. Social media has both advantages and disadvantages. I would like to mention here advantages of social media first. The biggest benefit of social media is that people can share thoughts and ideas with people across the world. Now, even a common man can express his opinion on any national or international issue. Another benefit of social media is that people can showcase their talent by this platform. Many people have gained fame by showing their talent through social media. It is also helping people to earn money. People sell a lot of things like clothes, books, electronic items, etc. Social media is also used to create awareness amongst people. People with good knowledge share topics like healing and nutrition use this platform to create awareness amongst people. Now, I would like to talk about the drawback of social media. Addiction is the biggest drawback of social media. People have got used to checking various their social media accounts every now and then. This is a lot of time used to checking various posters on social media. Spending a lot of time on social media also bring a lot of health disorders like stress and anxiety and sleeplessness. Another drawback of social media is that we cannot trust all the information available here. Some information can be true while some can be fake. All times false news spread by fire through this platform. Our personal information becomes easily to many on the net. Hence, we need to stay alert from hackers. A part of this cyberbullying is another major drawback of social media. Some people post negative and heat comments on others' account and harass them. The advantages like socializing have made our life simpler and convenient. There are some disadvantages too. We need to use this platform wisely and in a 